the Deathstalker Scorpion, a creature of duality. The deserts of North Africa and the Middle East are home to a fearsome arachnid, the Deathstalker Scorpion, Leurus quinquestriatus. Renowned for its potent venom, this scorpion commands both respect and terror. While a sting can cause excruciating pain, convulsions and even death, this venom holds promise in the fight against cancer. A potent predator. The Death Stalker lives up to its menacing name. Its venom is a complex cocktail of neurotoxins, targeting the nervous system and disrupting vital functions. Young children, the elderly, and individuals with underlying health conditions are particularly vulnerable to its effects. Thankfully, thanks to readily available antivenom, fatalities are rare. Despite its fearsome reputation, the Death Stalker plays a crucial role in its ecosystem. Primarily nocturnal, it hunts insects, spiders, and even small lizards. Their burrowing nature helps aerate desert soil, promoting healthy plant growth, breeding in captivity, friend or foe. The Death Stalker's ability to thrive in captivity has made it a popular choice for exotic pet owners. However, due to its aggressive nature and potentially lethal sting, keeping one requires specialized knowledge and responsible care. Escapes can pose a serious threat, especially in households with young children or vulnerable individuals. The ease of breeding death stalkers has also led to a rise in the venom trade. While research holds promise, milking venom from these scorpions can be dangerous and should only be done by trained professionals in controlled settings. From venom to hope, a medical marvel. While the immediate effects of a death stalker sting are severe, the underlying properties of its venom have captured the attention of medical researchers. Studies have shown that specific components in the venom target cancer cells, offering a potential new avenue for cancer treatment. These venom-derived compounds are still in the early stages of development, but their potential is significant. Unlike traditional therapies, they may offer a more targeted approach, minimizing damage to healthy cells. Further research could lead to breakthroughs in the fight against various cancers. Beyond the sting, a symbol of survival, the Deathstalker Scorpion's resilience and adaptability are remarkable. They can survive for extended periods without food or water, a testament to their ability to thrive in harsh desert environments. This characteristic tenacity has even earned them a place in traditional medicine in some cultures, where their body parts are used in unproven remedies. Respect, not fear, living alongside the Deathstalker. While the Deathstalker's sting demands respect, Understanding its role in the ecosystem and its potential medical applications paints a more nuanced picture. Conservation efforts focus on protecting these creatures while minimizing human scorpion encounters. Educating communities about the death stalker's behavior and the importance of seeking medical attention after a sting is crucial. Additionally, responsible exotic pet ownership practices minimize the risk of escape and ensure the well-being of both the scorpion and its keeper. The Death Stalker Scorpion is a complex creature, a reminder that nature often presents us with contradictions. With a healthy dose of respect and continued research, we can learn to coexist with this fascinating and potentially life-saving arachnid.